cars file in by the hundreds at this mobile pantry to receive food donations from the Food Bank of Delaware. As Coast TV News reporter Tori Seagraves shows us, there's a great need for food aid in Sussex County, especially ahead of the holidays. Cars line up and circle around Crossroad Community Church in Georgetown. Volunteers for the drive tell me this may be the busiest mobile pantry they've seen yet. Paula Gaiman has helped load food into the trunks of cars for the last three years. She says the turnout in Sussex County is overwhelming. It's always long. It's always long and there's always about a thousand plus cars that come to every mobile pantry. The food bank is handing out everything from apples to turkeys with a pan to cook it in. This pantry is the first of many to help lower food insecurity ahead of the holiday season, allowing people like Brenda Beebe to be able to have a Thanksgiving meal. We got a turkey, which is great because that's always one of the hardest to get. It's hard for a lot of people to be able to afford everything that they need. So this really does help out a lot. Dart Stuff the Bus also began today to collect non-perishable food donations to feed efforts at the Food Bank of Delaware, like this pantry. I mean, it just speaks to the generosity of our community, how folks really use that opportunity to give back, recognize that everyone should have something on their table for Thanksgiving, so it's always special to see those buses pull up. Making sure everyone has a reason to be thankful this Thanksgiving. If you are unable to make it out to the Rehoboth Beach Safeway today, you can also take donations to the Milford Walmart tomorrow from 9 to 4. I'm Tori Seagraves in Rehoboth Beach, Coast TV News.